Macroscopic mechanisms attract the T-cell to navigate the vascular system and travel to the antigen-containing lymph node. The draining node expands the diameters of its arterioles by 50%, ensuring more blood will pass through. In the high endothelial venule, the vessel the T-cell must extravasate through to get into the lymph node, fever increases the expression of thermosensitive molecules. Pro-inflammatory cytokines encourage the T-cell to move across the high endothelial venule at the specific draining node. Once in the lymph node, the T-cell faces the monumental task of finding a dendritic cell that is presenting the antigen. Microscopic mechanisms exist to help increase the odds. The dendritic cell itself has finger-like dendrites that sweep an area around the cell, sampling nearby T-cells. During development, collagen fibers become encased by fibroblastic reticular cells that secrete extracellular matrix proteins to create an intricate conduit system. The conduit system increases the chances that a T cell and an antigen presenting dendritic cell will meet up while traveling the same path. Macroscopic and microscopic mechanisms are imperative to initiate an immune response, ensuring the continual survival of the individual.